Hey, so I want to talk to you about two things that obviously we we all need in our business. The first one is testimonials, and that's straightforward. Everyone knows that you need to get more testimonials, put these testimonials up on your website, and ensure that um, you're reaching out to your customers and clients and asking them for these testimonials from time to time. Now, to put that into perspective, the best way to get testimonials is to make it easy for your clients or your customers to give you testimonials. So what I suggest most businesses do is create a couple of templates that you can share with your customers or your clients that say, listen, here's a template. You can copy and paste some of this information and could you draft up a template for us? Uh, sorry, not a template, a testimonial for us. One of the other things that I did that worked really well was I created like a little survey for the customers and I asked them these questions specifically. What did you find worked well? What did you like about our organization? What didn't you like? And I had about four or five questions and it came to them in a, in a form of a survey. And then what I said to them was when I sent out the survey, I said, look, the way you answer these questions will allow me to turn this into a testimonial and you won't need to uh, write a testimonial for me thereafter. So, you know, I got quite a lot of success and results with that. The, the second thing that I want you to do as well is create case studies. So think about problems uh, or situations when you solved an issue for a customer. What was that process like? What did you do? And turn that into a case study. So spend a bit of time, write down, you know, what was maybe the challenges what was the solution that you came up with? And then what was the final impact that that had on the customer? That well, these, these things work really well. So case studies work really well for service-based businesses, B2B types of businesses, because that way you can use that again, like I said, on your website as a marketing tool, as a, as a way for other business owners and other businesses to see some of the challenges. And a lot of times in business, some most businesses are having the same challenges as other businesses. So if you can show them how you solve that problem for a customer um, through a case study, that way they know what you can do and how you can help them as well. So yeah, a couple of quick tips there for you.